this seems to go beyond a friendship. Mm. I mean, they're both getting lots of needs met from this connection that they have. What's happening, everyone? Max here. We've got the man Uncle Harley with us today. Guys, thanks for joining us. My pleasure. Thank you for asking me. For sure. I yeah. thought we'd check out another Stray Kids, Two Kids room because I know Uncle Harley really enjoyed the first one. I did. And I definitely want to show him my guy over here, Han. As you know, I'm a big Han fan. So just in case you didn't know, and just in case you're new to my channel, I'm a communication skills coach, and Uncle Harley over here is a psychologist. All right, let's let it roll, baby. All right. 안녕, Han. <笑>ちゃあ、ビアよ。ちょっと気づろ。くれ。気づろ、ビアよ。あか、チーム米国だが、米国たくんなご。あ、もっとかっちゅうくんもちょっと振るがじゅう。ちょっと、いけんで。
굉장히 부끄럽고 부끄러워? 그거 굉장히 수치스러워 아니 카메라도 되고 나랑 영상 통화 하는 것처럼 한번 해줘 Yeah <웃음> I find these two both really funny Especially Han Han's yeah. like Dude, I find him absolutely hilarious But yeah. not over the top It's more subtle You know, he could have gone on with that joke about his him yeah. being shirtless Yeah, yeah But, you know, he just did a little He can be over the top He can oh, be really? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah okay. He can be okay. But not in an annoying way Because it's like He's such a star. Let's let him shine. Kind of thing. 내가 편의점 가서 물 사잖아. 그럼 사고 돌아오는 길에 힘들어. 편의점 네 숙소 내 숙소 이렇게 있고 이렇게 갔다가 편의점 가서 오는 길에 힘들어. 그렇게 멀진 않거든. 그 정도로 체력이 무도 어떻게 하냐고. 편의점으로 올라가 편의점 쉬다가 다시 내려가서 우리 집을 가지. 이상해. 약간. 들어와서 앉아서 휴대폰 보다 간다 가잖아. <laughs> Funny, yeah. it's a good conversation, yeah, man. It is a good conversation. Like you come over to my house for like a minute and you leave. Why do you even bother? Yeah, yeah. Also, the fact that he drops in for apparently no reason. I mean, he's saying because he wants a rest, but Han knows it's he. He just wants to see him, and so they want to keep their connection alive that uh -huh. way. I'm just going to drop by even for a second, exactly, just to connect with just you. Just to connect. It's actually amazing, guys, for me to watch this, for me yeah. to rewatch this. And yeah. see how open and just revealing Lino is. He's generally not this open and forthcoming and just loose. And Han's not, he, he can be very expressive and eccentric from my experience, but he's not like invasive in the sense that he's nosy. Right. So I think that works well with this guy's character. And obviously, I've had a lot more videos to work with, but mm -hmm. that's what I've sort of uncovered. Yeah, yeah, you're absolutely right. And I think that that's one of the draws for Lino mm. uh, to Han, is that he sees his authenticity, right? Yeah. He sees that he's just a genuine yes. person. Yes! And, and I think that's why he drops over several times a day or a week, <laughs> because he's saying, this is the guy I want to be. I, I really respect them. You know, not only does he make me laugh, yeah. <laughs> but th this dude is someone I'd want to aspire to, because he's just who he is. I think. Lino, maybe a little bit on the insecure side I'm going with. Okay. I'm just saying, just a touch. I'm just saying, right. of the two, yeah, I'm not yeah. saying he has an, a security problem. I'm yeah. just saying that yeah, yeah, Han yeah. seems so confident in who he yeah. is. It's like, it's very attractive. And yeah. I think for almost anybody. Yeah. And so anybody is less secure than Han almost. Right. <laughs> so that's why I think Lino he's attracted really to is that. attracted. Yeah. And he's got this uh, radiant smile too. Yeah, he really, yeah, he just yeah. radiates when he smiles. Yeah. He's a warm person. Oh, yeah. Do you know what you're talking about? There's three things. Happiness, sorrow, joy. What did he say? Sorry, do you know the feelings of jealousy? Three there's three there's only three in happiness, you. Sorrow, uh, joy, happiness, sadness. There's only three in you. Happiness, sadness. Happiness, sadness. Look, sorrow, joy. I'm not here. 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 이러고 슬픈 거 있으면 슬퍼 어, 이러고 팍 화나는 거 있으면 팍아 이러고 사람이 감정이 네 가지밖에 없을 생각. It's just light. It feels very light. It does. You know, yeah, yeah, they're not yeah. taking it too seriously. Like right, even right, when they right. talk about these subjects that uh, consider to be deeper right. or more intimate, it right. still has a very light tone. It does. It does. And, and nobody's looking to hurt each other, and nobody's looking to be defensive. They just seem like they feel free to say whatever to, yes. to each other. Yes. And Lino is is going along with his uh, bit very very well and not taking offense at it. And and so he's laughing. So it turns into a positive emotion. Yeah. So that that kind of humor can can feed into a like a stronger bond, a positive bond, and it works for these guys. 난 너의 주대를 음. 정말 멋있게 생각해. 너가 옛날에 나한테 그런 얘기를 했었어. 그 화려하게 입는 걸 좋아하잖아, 너가. 음. 근데 이제 멤버 애들이 그런 옷을 좀 과하다 막 이런 식으로 얘기를 했었잖아, 음. 옛날에. 음, 그렇지. 그랬는데 너는 이제 자기는 자기만의 기, 옷 스타일대로 가서 나중에 음. 진짜 멋있게 이렇게 입으면은 애들도 인정해 줄 거다라고 음. 얘기했었는데 어, 음. 요즘 괜찮아. 너 화려하게 안 입고 다니잖아. 어, 그래? <웃음> 나 어제도 니트에다 검은 슬랙스에다 흰 티셔츠 입고 왔어. <웃음> 그래도 넌 너의 주대를 지켰어. Yeah, yeah, they just go back and forth with compliments, and he said he appreciated his conviction. His conviction. His conviction. Yeah, yeah, yeah. that when people said oh, right. your clothing was a bit too much, uh, yeah. he said no, I'm going to do this, and yeah. people will eventually catch on to what I'm yeah. doing. And again, I think that's a huge draw yeah. for Lino, saying, yeah. man, this guy, like we talked about, he's before, authentic. He's totally. I'll dress how I want to dress. He is who he is, and yeah. that's that's a big appeal for yeah. him. Yeah, and that probably. 
inspires him to kind of do the same because I've commented before that he's kind of got a quirky side as well. Yeah. You know, there's an eccentric side to him too. So he seeing, allows it to come out. Seeing yeah. Han kind of do his thing completely and be yeah. himself completely kind of inspires him to do the same. You can tell they just love being around each other. Yeah, they bring out the yeah. best. It yeah. seems like that, yeah. right? It really does seem like that. It really like that. does. <laughs> but Han didn't, again, he likes to keep things, it seems, mm -hmm. just based on what I'm watching here, he likes to keep things at kind of a surface Doesn't level. Doesn't like to get too deep. Not too deep, mm -hmm. you know. Mm -hmm. At least three times, Lino has yeah. said, you've stood by your convictions and that's what's impressed mm -hmm. me. And he never really took it any deeper, mm -hmm. Han. He didn't really kind of... Explain. He doesn't take it in, doesn't internalize no. it, doesn't get he into it. he makes a joke about yeah, it. Yeah, yeah. I want to say, because he is an observant guy as well. He makes really good observations. And I feel like he's a guy who understands himself and other guys really well. But mm -hmm. he's also a guy who's like very interested in things. I don't know if this applies, but he's just very interested in like, you know, random different subjects, whether it's mm -hmm. like animals or food or space or, you know, he's just, he's interested in... Right. And things. So maybe right, that's right, where right, right, right. his brain is oriented a lot of the time as opposed yeah. to like exactly. his focus going is in to more people. Or, yeah. You know? Exactly. Exactly. <laughs> <laughs> that's funny <laughs> finds humor in everything uh, finds humor in everything huh? yeah. that's what you're noticing yeah, yeah. I agree <laughs> clean the world with your shoes yeah, yeah. That's, this is like a creative expression for him humor is like another sort of medium for him to express his creativity in a way right 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 it right. feels right. like to me when I watch him sometimes yeah and he could pour it all out there on, uh, on Lino uh, Lino. Lino loves it he loves it yeah, yeah. <laughs> and Han actually I think he might be a little bit more introverted when he's with new people. But once he gets comfortable with you, he's like, you know, the most extroverted guy in the room a yeah. lot of the time. So I think it's like with these two guys when they're together and they've like found, like, now we can really kind of just express mm -hmm. who we are. It's almost yeah. like another level to it all. You're describing it perfectly. And, and what you're describing as well is a very intimate relationship, emotional, mm. intimate relationship. Mm. And... This is what happens when you have that kind of an attachment with someone, when you feel totally safe and secure within their presence, you could say anything and you know they're going to support you, back you. I mean, yeah. this is a, like a tight attachment. Yeah. This, isn't, this, is, this seems to go beyond a friendship. Mm. I mean, they're both getting lots of needs met from this connection that they have. Yeah, yeah. like a brotherhood, like a, brotherhood. a strong yeah, brotherhood. Yeah, yeah. Food was the number one thing that brought them together. But beyond that, yeah. they developed a very sort of tight psychological bond. Again, he's validating him, right? Yeah. <laughs> Be who you are. I like that you're weird. <laughs> He's always making fun of him in such a, in a, in a good way. Yeah, 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 calling him weird. But once again, Han got into something deep for like a minute and a half or less. He didn't tell, he didn't kind of like tell him why mm. like you know you're such a good listener you're really supportive you understand me he doesn't he doesn't seem to take it to the next level instead he just m makes a joke out of it he's basically saying you're there for me and you're weird yeah <laughs> you know and then they laugh together yeah. But, but I don't know, think they're Lino, telling yeah, each, yeah, I don't think Lino needs that. I don't think it, not that you're saying that. I'm yeah. just saying I don't think Lino needs that extra layer of depth. You know, like I don't think mm. he needs Han to say, you're such a good listener and it's because you're so sensitive and it's because you do this, this, and this specifically. You know, it's enough for Han to sort of accept Lino fully for who he is and mm -hmm. be the source of comfort for him. 
for sure. Yeah. But lots, but lots. Han is picking out, you know, reasons why this relationship works so well because yeah. you're there for me when I need you. Mm -hmm. So at least he's letting him know. At least at that level, you're an important person in my life. Yeah, yeah. He's not all fun and jokes. He, yeah, yeah. Uh, oh, he's he, serious. Oh, he. But to a level. Yeah, right, right. <laughs> 리누 형이 더 좋아하는 것 같아. 리누 형이 한이한테 의지를 더 많이 하는 것 같은데. 한이는 딱히 리누 형 없어도 잘살수 있는 것 같은데. 리누 형은 한이 없으면 못살것 같아. 나도 약간 그런 느낌이야. 그런 느낌이 좀 들어. 한이는 그리고 누구한테 의지하는 스타일이 아니에요. 나도 형 공연 많이 들었을 거야. Very independent guy, mm -hmm. like they're saying. I don't know if I would agree with them that uh, Han would be just as well off without uh, Lino. I think he's found uh, like a soulmate of sorts mm. right there. Mm. So I, I think I think the fan base actually refers to these two as really? soulmates. Yeah. So yeah. I, I think Han would get on with his life, mm -hmm. but I think there would be a real void finding a person that understood him mm. like that, and yeah. that he could just sort of be in his own self, unfiltered, right. and be accepted. Yeah. And and Lino doesn't put a lot of pressure on him. To, to really reveal himself terribly. Yeah, that's interesting. I don't think I thought about that angle. Han probably appreciates that. Yeah. Lino Very doesn't much. cry. Lino doesn't get, like, you know, he doesn't get into me too much. Exactly. He doesn't so, put too many emotional demands on Both these guys don't, on don't yeah. put emotional demands no. on each other. No, no. Huh, yeah. yeah. They don't, but at the same time, Max, it's really a very complicated relationship they have. It's, it's very deep-rooted. I mean, on the surface, yeah. it seems very su superficial with the, uh, the laughing and the joking and yeah. the humor, but... Uh, there's no doubt that throughout their conversation, they kept inserting compliments to each other and explaining why you're important to me. Yeah. You know, just that kind of like friendship building, bond building kind of information you want to share with another person. Yeah. So I think it's very complicated is what I'm saying, yeah. even though they don't necessarily go real yeah. deep yeah. into uh, specific feelings. Yeah. There's sort of a recognition of it mm -hmm. and acceptance that, well, let's take it to this level mm -hmm. and we're good to go. Yeah. Yeah, he's uh, Han. Particularly, seems to be a more complicated guy that uh, yeah, you know, take would take some serious figuring out. Ah, 아, 그거. 약간 좀 힙해 그게 힙합을 좋아하는구나. 어. 형이랑 곡 작업을 한번 더 해보고 싶어. 그때 아이삼의 그때 잘하기도 음. 했고 항상 뭐 탑라인이나 그런 걸 쓰면 굉장히 잘 갖고 오는 사람이기 때문에 해보고 싶고 음. 그런 노래를 한번 해봤으면 좋겠어. <웃음> 띠, 이티, 무슨 노래? 이티. <웃음> 약간 <웃음> 섹시한. <웃음> 그런... See that. Although this was small, and I remember watching this when yeah. I first reacted to this video, although this is small, <laughs> I think this little sort of moment is telling of not only them as individuals, but of their dynamic. Mm -hmm. <laughs> you know, Lino's initiating yeah. the humor because he wants to like bond in that way with yeah, Han. Yeah, yeah, and yeah. Han's matching it immediately. Yeah. Like Han is happy just to switch his brain and go there to the, exactly. the, the, the weird joke. And yeah. I think that kind of encapsulates their humor, that similar sort of like yeah. unique humor that they that's share. Right. That's right, that's right. The uniqueness of it is really interesting. They just kind of like, they just kind of glide into each other's movements and that finger tapping, they got it right on the yeah. finger too. Yeah, yeah. No missing. Yeah, <laughs> that's yeah. true. And then Han yeah. goes, E.T., right? Yeah, just takes it to another funny. level of yeah. weirdness. It's yeah. funny, yeah. yeah, it's hilarious. Yeah. <laughs> and then right back to the conversation. Now right. they're right back into the conversation. I see him laugh, but like that was like a genuine belly laugh. His mind never seems to really shut off. So just a sign of him just kind of being in the present moment and genuinely laughing mm -hmm. was nice for mm -hmm. me to see. And it's just, I'm glad that Lino can kind of provide that right. moment right, for right. him. That's not true happiness right there. They're sort of like just yes. lost in the moment. And as you pointed out, right, exactly. he's just being his true self and just expressing his laughter and his yeah. feeling of happiness. Mm -hmm. and, that's a great place to be in, and it is. He's got a buddy there that he can share that with. What did I think of soulmate? I think of soulmate. Yeah, genuine soulmate. I don't think about it. 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 So, <laughs> 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 
<laughs> I'll play the car. <laughs> it's just not awkward or cringy at all for Han to say to Lino, right. you still think we're soulmates? Right. Like right. Han, right, right. It, there's no discomfort yeah. for Han to go there. Yeah, yeah. He's telling him, I love you in all different ways. In all but, different ways. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Did, but did you see Lino? He, he wasn't having any of it, though. He wasn't having any of what? You know, uh, you know, that okay. discussion about soulmate, man. I mean, that's a heavy, like you said, that's a heavy message to deliver mm. to somebody. And so, he, uh, yeah. he just made a joke of it. Mm. So again, I think that they've managed to kind of fine tune their relationship where they'll, they'll talk about some serious topics at, at the most superficial level. But it works for both of them because mm -hmm. they, they both want to touch on something, some sensitive issues, mm -hmm. but they don't want to go too down into it. They're able to to maintain that mm -hmm. that connection without having to get into like the deep emotional yeah, yeah. stuff. So yeah. it doesn't necessarily have to be in no. every relationship. No, it works it for some people and not yeah. So it doesn't mean it's unhealthy. Not it's at just all. their style. Yeah. Yeah. It's not like they stop saying they don't get turned off by each other when one says something sensitive or loving to mm -hmm. the other, you know, in a friendship way. Yeah. No. Yeah, they just keep giving it back to each other. Yeah. It's kinda like I don't know, maybe in like in a tennis match, it's like a soft volley. Mm -hmm. Here, I love you. Yeah. And the other one said, I, I love, love you too. too. Yeah. Instead of, I love yeah, you yeah. because you do this for me, you yeah. do that for me. It's just easier for them to yeah. receive it in yeah. that less direct yeah. way, yeah. Yeah. in that yeah. lighter, softer, more high yeah. level way. Yeah. But overall, this is a great relationship yeah. that works for the both oh, of them. Oh, yeah. yeah. And they've established a yeah. pattern of behavior and right. communication that's worked really, really well for them. Right. They're both super comfortable with. Right. They make each other happy. We're one. Yeah. Fight. Yeah. Mm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> they know too. <laughs> We're the perfect. Yeah. Uh, they know. Friends, yeah. They know. They know yeah. they're a perfect match for each other. Yeah. They know that. Yeah. Cool, man. So, what'd you think? You enjoyed that? I did. These guys are terrific, just solid individuals. And, uh, yes. you know, there are people that you can look, they are people that you can look up to and mm -hmm. you can see yourself wanting to be like them mm -hmm. in some way or take some kind of yeah. quality and improve yourself in some way from them. So yeah, yeah. you can really, you know, add to your own identity by yeah. following these guys. So uh, that's awesome, man. I, I think love I, it. I, 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 you love uh, I love this because yeah. I get to kind of look at these guys and, and, and see really, really good people. These guys right. are amazing, and I'm glad to be able to share that That's with awesome, you man. with Stay. And I think uh, I can speak on behalf of all of us that it's been a pleasure having Uncle Harley here. We've really appreciated your, your insight, your input, and your, uh, you know, your authenticity, man. Thank so you, this this is our last uh, our last this is our last little for video together for a bit. We'll we'll yeah. do it again soon. We're going to yeah. continue a series. But other than that, guys, if you want to watch our uncut reaction and analysis, all you need to do is click on the Patreon link below. Other than that, we appreciate you, and we'll talk to you soon. Peace. Peace out, guys.